58 year old Chinakanu Sivasankaran's rise from a fabrication contractor with Chennai Petroleum Company to one of India's most prolific deal makers is legendary. Gifted with an exceptional ability to spot opportunities and make profitable exits, came naturally to Siva, as he's called in business circles. His diverse portfolio spanned Tata Tele Services, Aircel, Barista, Tamil Nadu Mercantile Bank, and even real estate investments in Sahara's Ambi Valley. Siva was once a close friend and advisor of Ratan Tata when the telecom boom was just taking off in India. But Siva stayed out of the public eye, except when he testified against Dayanidhi Maran to the CBI three years back, alleging that Maran forced him to sell Aircel to Maxis in 2006. But cut to 2014. And today, Telecom, which earned Siva most of his fortune, has come back to haunt him. A failed joint venture with Bahrain's Patelco, leading to a claim of $212 million, forced Siva to file for bankruptcy in a Seychelles court. The move and attempt to prevent a run on his personal assets, which includes private jets and residences around the world, comes at a time when his other businesses are already under strain. His recent ventures in wind energy, water and shipping failed to take off, taking the sheen off the success he scripted all these years. But people close to Shivashankaran are not willing to write him off just yet. Not just in the Batelco case, which they say arose out of extraordinary circumstances due to the cancellation of 2G licenses, but his other business interests as well. It remains to be seen if Shivashankaran, who's fought and won many hostile battles, can get his Midas touch again. Chandra R. Shrikant, ET Now, Bangalore. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash etnow and don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at etnowlive. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com slash user slash etnow.